All right, everybody. This is Luke Stanky. I'm a Tableau Zen Master, and today I'm here to talk to you about Tableau 2020.4's premier release. In this release, we're talking about the ability to create prep flows on your Tableau online or Tableau server instance. This is the feature that they are called, that is really the highlight for Tableau of, of the release. And I'm just going to hop on to our personal tessellation Tableau online instance. And I wanna show you how easy it really is to get started. I have clicked the explore button. You'll notice also on the left side, I've got a lot of options, but under explore, I now have an option for new and on new, I can just choose flow. So I'm just gonna click flow. It's going to load up Tableau Prep and it's actually gonna be quite seamless to the desktop experience. That's because the way that the Tableau Prep desktop experience was created was actually designed as a web browser to begin with so that it really could just be placed inside of your, a, a, an online instance with almost no issues. I'm going to connect to data here same exact view as we've seen before. I'll do a search here. I'm gonna do a Google Drive uh, connection and I'm gonna go connect to Superstore on my own email instance. So I'm just gonna get connected here and then I'm gonna search uh, all the way down here for sample Superstore. I have it in a Google Sheet. So I'm gonna to connect to that data source and it's loading up here in just a second. So now that I've connected, I can just click and drag my table over and let's do some analysis. Just if we were in Tableau prep, let's calculate like the, the start. We'll, we'll calculate the cohorts for every individual in Superstore sales. So we have customer IDs and we can figure out their first start date and that we'll, we'll create the cohorts by quarter. So I'm just going to click the plus button, choose clean step, and we're going to create our cohorts with two calculations. Again, it looks just like Tableau Prep. I'm just gonna call this recent nearest quarter. So nearest quarter, we're gonna roll our data to that. I'm gonna use the date trunk function by quarter, and I'm gonna use a field called order date. And that's gonna create this nearest quarter. And again, this is gonna feel just like the desktop experience because it really is just the desktop experience. And that, like I said, you can layer these things on here. So we could say cohort, actually, yeah, we'll call it cohort. And then it's going to be fixed. And we're gonna get rid of that one extra bracket, fixed by customer ID. And now we can just say min quarter nearest quarter here. And this will calculate our cohort. And of course, Tableau prep full functionality as you've seen before, we have the ability to aggregate that data up. Let's aggregate that by quarter. Again, using some, so by cohort. So let's group this by cohort and then we'll just, let's sum up sales and let's sum up profit and roll those values up here. So I'm just rolling those values up in my grouped field. So let's group things up and ag aggregate up sales by and profit by sum. And then finally, our last step in this process is we can output that data. So I'm gonna to go to output and you'll notice here's our cohort dates rolling through and I can, I have an error to begin with. That's because I need to select a project. Let's just shoot this out to our CPG and I'm just going to call this cohort flow. And I believe I already created a cohort flow and prep for this, but I'm just gonna click run flow, publish changes, and then I actually have to publish this flow itself out. So I'm gonna also publish that in my CPG folder here and call this cohort prep flow. And I'm going to hit embed credentials and publish. And now I can schedule this out just like I would with my, my prep flows. And I can also, there it's published. And now let's run this flow just to make sure that it creates the data source and it's been added to the queue. So now let's just click view flow and maybe we'll be able to see that flow. Yep, there it is. It's on Tableau server ready to roll. So that's it. That's the, the big release. It is a nice seamless integration of Tableau's 
prep tool on your server and on your online instance. It actually is really great. I, I certainly think I plan on using it quite more frequently because I can just hop right in to Tableau Prep on my server, build out what I'm looking for and just continue my day. Such a really easy way to do it. So that's it. We've got a total of five videos for this 2020.4 release that we're creating. Hopefully you're checking out all of them. If you haven't, go ahead and check them out today. If you did this video, feel free to like and subscribe. Add a comment if you have any comments of additional features you want us to highlight because we are only covering all five here. That said, have a great day.